Hey guys, today I'll be doing a review on the application Sudoku 2. Let me. Okay, so it's currently free in the application store, as this is a small promotion towards the application since it was only released about seven days ago. So here we've got a few options. Um, you can either turn on and off the tiles. So if you want a more of a paper feel, um, you can turn off the tiles. Or if you want a 3D feel, you can turn on the tiles. And uh, we're just going to go straight into play. And uh, here we've got a few options. Easy, medium and hard. Uh, these are originally locked at medium and hard. Um, but since you need to complete easy three four times in a row, I believe. And uh, you unlock medium. So here it is. Um, so it's very simple, just like a Sudoku. Uh, if you haven't heard of Sudoku, please just go check out um, like some websites, Wikipedia, and it'll demonstrate how to play the game and um, like what it's all about. Since um, it's, I don't have enough time to explain to you how to play, but um, if you've played it before, uh, that's great because this is pretty much an easier version of Sudoku. So, you know, as you can see, there are tiles everywhere and stuff, and um, just like the normal Sudoku game. And um, if, you, if you've if you played it um, and you know some strategies, you probably know the most common one, which is the three-line, um, the three-row trick, where basically you get th three numbers, these, in th these three blocks, um, there are th three ones, right? So one for each, obviously, and um, so if there's only two, uh, they cover up those two ro those two rows. You cannot have two um, ones in the same row, two of the same number in the same row. So therefore, if it's not if you, so you can't put them in in the top two rows. Therefore, it has to be in the third row. So you can easily you already know it's just one, and um, you can also use this strategy for the next one. But this time we've got two possibilities, so um, it's either here or here, right? Because of this two, those two rows are taken, so the third one must be somewhere there. Then you check the horizontal side. So the horizontal, um, there's one there, so that means it has to go there, because it cannot overlap. So yeah, um, the reason why I got that so quickly was because you can easily just tap a number in, in this game, and... Uh, it will automatically show all the number ones right so you don't have to um, look for them yourselves which will save you a bit of time so yeah that's one of the features which I really enjoy uh, the second one is note taking uh, this makes everything a lot easier so let's say this row has a po more than one possibility so this let's just say just one this one um, this could be for number one. Number one could be placed there, or um, say number six, seven, seven. And um, there, there are a whole lot of numbers which ha which could go there, right? But um, like you can't just like guess one. So you kind of want to make a note for future reference. Um, to like say which which numbers are available for that uh, for that block, and um, you can just put the notes down, and you can easily take them out as well. Um, and then there's one the third tip um, with the third um, thing that which I really enjoy, um, and it makes this game a lot simpler is the hints. So you get three hints for easy mode, two for medium, and I think one for hard. So all you have to do is tap this little thing. Okay, so you tap the block you want to know um, the number to. Then you tap the hint button, and it will tell you which number. And uh, if you didn't see that, it was eight. And you just um, click eight, and then it will show you. Um, that, well, you just put it in because it's automatically correct. So yeah, that's the th the three things that make the game so much simpler, and. Um, Without those, it will actually create make the process a lot slower. So um, that's why I really enjoy it. I've I haven't seen many applications with so many features which can help beginners um, with their Sudoku. And uh, yeah, so it just makes the game a lot more fun and uh, enjoyable. So 
um, that's pretty much it. Um, just a basic Sudoku game with just you know a lot of all these really um, these extra features which makes the game fun. And also, by the way, it's associated with Open Faint, and uh, at the top it will show you your multiplier. So each time you fill in a number, your score will be times by this amount. Um, the longer you take, the lower the multiplier will be. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it for this review. Thanks for watching. Um, please go check it out. Link will be in the description below. And I'll see you later.